Vegas off and bring you another super fantastic game. The 1968 Ford Mustang Fastback and it's a true GT 302. And uh, this one bad boy has dual quads in the shelter. Uh, so it's a pretty nice setup and feel And on the hood, she looks perfect. The paint looks absolutely stunning. The undercarriage on this car looks like it rolled out of the factory. Uh, it's a nice, nice car that's been fully restored. A lot of nice work. Nice work. And uh, it runs perfect. But, uh, as you walk around the city, you can see how beautiful it is. It is absolutely gorgeous. All the bright work on it, the chrome. Pretty much everything looks like brand new. There's a couple little chips. Like there's a teeny little chip right there on the nose. Minor stuff, though. In fact, we'll probably touch that up before it even goes out. But uh, this car was a very well done car. As you look down the side, you can see the quality of the paint and the lines. The body lines are absolutely stunning on this car. Real show vehicle. Windshield, all the rubbers brand new. Everything works on this car. It's a J code. I don't know if you can see that there. But uh, 68J code, which was the uh, actual GTs. It's got that reflective paint stripe on it. It's pretty cool, or tape stripe. These American racing wheels with vintage looking GT Eagles STs on it. It's uh, really look tasteful on this car. Gives it that uh, almost uh, like the bullet vehicle type wheels on it dual exhausts on this thing, crossovers underneath. When you see pictures of this undercarriage, you're going to really appreciate the quality of this car. Excellent body work on this car. You can see the lines up through the, all the way up through the roof of the car and down through the trunk. Very well done. Again, the bright work on this thing is perfect. Look at those lines down that side of that car. Absolutely beautiful. And this car runs is pretty and nice, as you see in the pictures here. Let's open up the hood, show you that, because it is absolutely gorgeous under the hood. See the workmanship there? Everything's super clean on this thing. Everything looks like new. A lot of nice parts on it, the Optima battery, chrome alternator there, Ford cap there. It's not fully stock, it's got power steering which is real nice. But there's what's cool right there, those dual quads that pump out a lot of power on this car. Got the standard brake system, but it's also got a um, booster underneath there that you can regulate uh, disc brakes front to rear on this thing. As you can see the engine all really nicely done. This car is just really, really nice. There was some metal work done to this car back in the day, but it's been really well done and professionally well done. Matching in on the Fender there. Be able to see that. Oh, there you go. You can probably see it now. Just look, nice little touches on it. Just really nice little touches right there in the back. Fuel pressure regulator right there. Just nice stuff. The builder of this car did a nice job. And the best part is that it's a solid solid build right now that does not need a thing this car runs and drives out absolutely beautiful so let's show you that and take it for a ride door panels match up close tight all the rubbers new on it the interior is absolutely gorgeous this car original steering wheel inside See, it's in great shape Headliner, everything, everything's in great shape. This car. Dash is like new. Got a nice sound system in it. Only thing they added.
added on the interior was the tachometer that you can see there. Beautiful interior though, beautiful seats, beautiful headliner. Everything's just really nice in this car. Of course that seat lays down. First shifter on it. Has the uh, over the shoulder seat belts as well. Fog lamps down there. Let's take this thing for a spin. No, we're not going to go four-wheeling. Get off this dirt out here. I don't like driving my cars in the dirt, but I got some event going on over there where I usually do pictures in my videos. Power steering makes this thing really, really nice to drive. Bought this out of Southern Utah from a collector that had two Mustangs that we bought from him on the same day. This Fastback and a really rare 1966 uh, K-Code Mustang convertible. Which, uh, K-Codes for you Mustang guys, you know how rare those are. And uh, the next vehicle we'll be doing the photo shoots on. So you'll see that one pretty soon here. But this one I drove all the way back from St. George, Utah, back to Las Vegas with not a glitch. Really enjoyed the drive. Very nice. Turn signals work, brake lights work, everything works on the car. And she's got power. Really just a no complaints car at all. If you're uh, looking for a museum piece, I'm not gonna call it a museum piece just from the standpoint of, I know there's been metal work done on it and also there's, the paint has a few little, what I call it, tiny little blemishes, but nothing to really deter you from looking at the car that's really what it is, a really showy, absolutely beautiful car. And uh, unquestionably fantastic as far as the build, paint quality, and everything. Um, so if you have any questions about it, feel free to call me. Um, I always post my phone number in my ads. Uh, the one thing I don't do is post my price or what my bottom line is, which is pretty dumb, unless somebody's willing to make an offer be a serious buyer that number doesn't matter so the only way to get that conversation going is to call me and that number is 702-353-7500 and that's how you'll get a conversation going about what you can buy this car for so give me a holler and I'd be happy to talk about what you're willing to offer on this thing after you see all the pictures I know that you'll know exactly what you need to spend or what you can spend on your budget and if your budget is big enough to make it happen well, then it'll happen with a phone call. So make sure you call me and don't email me. I don't respond to emails or texts asking for that. Thanks again. We'll see you. And this is Doug Williams at Viva Las Vegas Autos.